Well, Roland, thank you for the time that you've taken to talk to Namper during this interview. Since we have seen these wonderful bees here that we've observed, and you're a beekeeper, so what inspired you to become a beekeeper? Yes, uh, it started uh, with my father. My father was already a, a well-known beekeeper. They call him the Biedengraf. Mm-hmm. And uh, he knows, he knew a lot of things about bees. Mm-hmm. And then when he died in uh, 1998, Mm-hmm. I took over the bees, and first I took uh, I s- uh, think about it to do only as a hobby and do bees like this, okay. like this uh, they are, and t- to make a little honey for us and for my friends. Mm-hmm. At the beginning, when I started with bees, I never realized how important they are. They uh, the honey bees uh, uh, pollinate up to 80 percent of our plants, and if there are no uh, plants anymore, you can realize how uh, the human being will suffer to survive. The propolis, it is very good to build up your immune system if you take the propolis as the glue of the bees where they uh, cover up every space of the, um, of the hive. Yeah. And that is all what the uh, human bees can take. And the bees, they also use them for themselves. Uh, they also uh, cover the entrance and everything with this propolis and if they go into, into the entrance of the hive they take up uh, some of this propolis and they strengthen their, strengthen their immune system. Our bees can be quite aggressive, yeah. Uh, if they are small they are not so aggressive but as soon as they got more honey and a uh, lot of breed bees, young bees, then they uh, can get their very quite uh, uh, big aggressive. They also kill, uh, call them killer bees, but that's, that is wrong. Uh, every animal is only, uh, if you work with the nature and uh, go to the bees with the um, special uh, energy and everything, the bees won't uh, kill you, that they won't uh, do something. Yeah. Can anybody just be a beekeeper? Uh, normally everybody, but uh, it is very dangerous if you are allergic. Because if you get, uh, if you are allergic and you get a, a bee sting, you can get killed by one uh, bee sting. So normally everybody can be uh, work with bees, but you must have a, a, a connection to the nature, and you must uh, uh, be calm. Uh, working with bees is not uh, a hurry up job. You must have time. You must take your time to do. You can see it behind it or uh, on the on the movie now uh, how we work with the bees. It's take a time to get uh, the bees in the box, and now we still must uh, looking for the queen. Uh, so, and if you start with beekeeping, you must uh, normally uh, you must start with a course or to get to go to a beekeeper who shows you how to do it and you can't do it and learn it in uh, one or two days yeah well Roland tell us what are the enemies of bees Uh, yeah there are a lot of enemies which we got here in Namibia I think more than Europe and the most problem we get with the enemies is the human being they destroy the bees uh, the bees and kill the bees and uh, burn the bees down uh, and uh, yeah to get the honey example yeah, that is one most important uh, enemy, but we've got still a lot of them. One is the uh, uh, baboons who can s- destroy the uh, beehives. Then we've got the uh, honey butcher, and uh, from the small insect there is a hive beetle, that's a, a small black uh, beetle insect. And then we've got the uh, a, a moth that we call um, wax moth, they're going into the hive. And that if the combs are old, they go in and then they destroy the whole uh, hive, the whole combs, yeah. Do all bees uh, produce honey? Uh, only the honeybees. There's, uh, there are honeybees, they are social uh, insects, that means they make making a nest and they all produce uh, uh, honey. We got in, in Africa ten different sorts of honeybees, they only belong, all belong to the Apis mellifera and uh, they all produce honey. Yeah. I've got here a piece of uh, honeycombs which I removed out of the nest. So I will give Charlotte uh, this piece here to, that you can taste it. Mm-hmm. How Namibian honey um, looks like and s- is smelled. Yeah. And I also uh, take a 
Mm. Mm. It's very fresh honey, it's white honey, light honey and... Um, it is. Well, this is not just a simple sweet story. Well, I hope you have learned something from this educative story. And next time you encounter a bee, please do not kill bees, because we've just learned the values of bees. I am Charlotte Nambaja reporting from Nampa News.